Hi, this particular video is being created to show lecturers how to input the grades for their students. So you log into your AORian account and after logging in, you simply go down to student management and you would see the grade entry view. So upon logging in, you would see your dashboard and you go to student management and you select grade entry view. Upon selecting it, it will give you an option of entering the term that you want to select to enter these grades. So, for me, it will be at this point, year 2016, is going to be the first semester, is going to be undergraduate, and the campus I am looking for specifically in this video would be Maine. Of course, um, if you are on the extension sites, you would need to select the site that you're on. So, for those who are in the Barbados extension site, um, you would have to select Barbados and then you show courses. In this particular instance, I myself have a course that is running out of the Barbados satellite site. So when you're selecting the course that you're looking for, you must be careful and select the campus that is running your course. So if it's a course that is being run from the main campus, it's going to be main. And if it's a course being run specifically out of a particular satellite site, be it Antigua, Barbados, Belize, Guyana, or so forth, you have to select that. And of course, upon doing that, you click Show My Courses. So this particular course is from Barbados. And if I click View Class, it gives me the option of all of the students, student IDs, and then I need to go to Enter Grades. And in Entering Grades, it now gives me the option of selecting the grade that the student would have received for the entirety of the course and that's the process so you would have possibly create entered all the grades for the students and marks under the application that we use traditionally utilize at USC which would be grade keeper or if you utilize any other application after having found out what the students final grade is you then come and input the final grade and after doing that you'd of course update grade in this particular video, I have no grades to put in at this point, so I won't update it, but that's the process. So again, start from the beginning. Upon logging in, you would come to your dashboard. You go to Student Management, select Grade Entry View. Upon doing so, you will now be required to input the semester and year that you're looking for. So I'm going to click First Semesters in 2016. It's an undergraduate course I'm looking for, and this time I'm going to select Main Campus, show my courses, and another course comes up. Click to view class. So, click to view class, number of students come up, I go to enter grades. You realize that it says grade entry open simply because no grades have been placed in as yet. After you click enter grade, it changes to update grade because as soon as you put in the grades for each relevant student, you'll be required to update the grade and that would be it. So I'm just going to click cancel um, as I have nothing to enter at this point in time. So that's the process to enter in your grades. So now as you're ready, you can follow that process and you'll be on your way to submitting your grades as a facilitator. Thank you.